Python tutorial Fama French 3 factors model. Asset pricing models consist of estimating asset expected return through its expected risk premium linear relationship with factors portfolio's expected risk premiums and macroeconomic factors. This topic is part of investment portfolio analysis with Python Curse. Feel free to take a look at Curse curriculum by clicking link at the description box below. This tutorial has an educational and informational purpose and doesn't constitute any type of trading or investment advice. Please read full tutorial disclaimer at the end of this video. Fama French 3 factors model consists of estimating asset expected return through the expected risk premium linear relationship with market expected risk premium, size and investment style factors portfolio's expected returns. Size factor corresponds to long small stocks portfolio and short big stocks portfolio. Investment style factor corresponds to long value stocks portfolio and short growth stocks portfolio. Value corresponds to high book to market stock ratio and growth corresponds to low book to market stock ratio. Book to market stock ratio corresponds to shareholders equity per share divided by market value per share. For full reference, I recommend that you read Eugene Fama and Kenneth French, Common Risk Factors in the Returns of Stocks and Bonds, published in the Journal of Financial Economics in 1992. As a formula, the expected asset return is equal to the expected risk free rate return plus a beta 1 coefficient multiplied by the difference between the expected market return minus the expected risk free rate return plus a beta 2 coefficient multiplied by the expected small minus big portfolio return plus a beta 3 coefficient multiplied by the expected high minus low portfolio return. Small minus big portfolio is equal to 1 divided by 3 multiplied by small value plus small neutral plus small growth portfolios minus 1 divided by 3 multiplied by big value plus big neutral plus big growth portfolios. High minus low portfolio is equal to 1 divided by 2 multiplied by small value plus big value portfolios minus 1 divided by 2 multiplied by small growth plus big growth portfolios. Excellent. So let's go into Python PyCharm IDE so that we can study Fama French 3 factors model with greater detail. Perfect. So here we are within PyCharm IDE. In this tutorial, we'll be working within Python tutorial Fama French 3 Factors model code file. So the first step within the tutorial is to do packages importing. So we're going to import NumPy SMP, Pandas SPD, and then from stats models, we're going to import regression.linear model as LM, and then tool.tools as CT for the corresponding regression constant or intercept. The next step is to create data for Fama French 3 factors model calculation. So we create an object named returns, which is equal to PD or pandas dot read underscore CSV. And within it, we have the path to the data file found within data directory and the name of the file Fama French 3 factors models data as a plain text file with dot CSV or comma separated values. Index column as date and we parse those dates as true. So let's go ahead and open that data file. As we can see here, we have a plain text file with dot CSV or comma separated values. The first of these columns corresponds to dates, dates with a monthly frequency from the beginning of 2007 all the way to the end of 2016, therefore 10 years of data. The next column corresponds to SPY minus RF. That corresponds to the asset risk premium, in this case the asset as SPY, which corresponds to the ETF investment vehicle, which intends to replicate the standard and pulse current index. Therefore here we have SPY monthly arithmetic returns minus the corresponding month risk free rate of return for the asset risk premium. Then we have MKT minus RF, that corresponds to the market risk premium. Therefore, here we have the market portfolio monthly arithmetic returns minus the corresponding month risk free rate of return for the market risk premium. Then we have SMB, which stands for small minus big, and here we have the monthly arithmetic returns of the small minus big portfolio. And last we have HML, which stands for high minus low, Therefore, here we have the monthly arithmetic returns of the high minus low portfolio. So back into the code file, once we've read the data, we can continue with Fama French 3 factors model calculation. So the first step is to that returns object, we need to add a new column with the constant or intercept. So we have returns.loc and we open and close 
Therefore, we have semicolons to select all the rows, comma, and we're creating a new column named CT for that constant or intercept, which is equal to that CT feature from stats models dot add underscore constant of those returns. And the following step is we are going to fit the linear regression for Fama French three factors model calculation. So we're going to name it FF3 for Fama Fr French three factors model, and it's going to be equal to LM feature from stats OLS, which or from the returns object, we select SPY minus RF, which is the asset risk premium as a dependent or explained variable, comma, and then from that same returns object, we are selecting, as we can see with double brackets, the following columns, CT for the constant or intercept, and then all the independent or explanatory variables, MKT minus RF, the market risk premium, SMB, which stands for small minus big portfolio, and HML, which stands for high minus low portfolio. Comma has a constant equals to boolean, dot fit, open, and close parentheses. And the following step is we're going to print those results. So we put a blank space, then the FEMA French three factors model linear regression summary, another blank space, and then from that object we fit it above with that summary, we print the summary of that corresponding linear regression. So let's go ahead and run the code file. When you're doing it for the first time, at any part of the code here, you click the right bottom of the mouse and scroll down into the code file name to run it. But as I've done it before recording this video tutorial, the name's already stored here, Python tutorial from a French three factors model. So I just go ahead, select it and click run. running console and we see the summary of that regression being printed. So we scroll to the top and we see FEMA French factors model linear regression summary, the OLS or ordinary least squares regression results, and specifically we scroll down and we focus on the coefficient for that corresponding linear regression. So first we have the coefficient for the constant or intercept that corresponds to the asset average realized excess return according to Fama French three factors model. Then we have beta one coefficient, this one related to the market risk premium. Then we have beta two coefficient, the one related to the small minus big factor portfolio. And then we have beta three coefficient, the one related to the high minus low factor portfolio. Excellent. So now that we've finished studying Fama French three factors model, let's go back into the slides. And as mentioned previously, this tutorial has an educational and informational purpose and doesn't constitute any type of trading or investment advice. Please pause the video now so you can read the full tutorial disclaimer. Okay, so with this, we finish this tutorial. Thank you for watching.